Hi and welcome to HMB. This week for the Q&A we're going to talk about something quite personal and uh, well actually a quite personal but linked to wine question. It's linked to consumption. I'll see you in a minute. Hi and welcome to Shabby. I hope you had a wonderful day, a wonderful week. We're back for the Q&A and this week, this amazingly kind of personal question about wine consumption. Indeed, I was asked, how much wine do you drink on a weekly or daily basis? Well, it's not that personal. But I understand why you would ask me the question as I'm a wine professional. And as a wine shop owner and as a wine bar owner, you might think that I tend to drink quite a lot. Now, this can come as some kind of a shock to you, but I actually don't drink. I mean, not really don't drink, but I don't drink as much as most people feel. And just because I post about wines all the time, about tastings all the time, doesn't mean I'm going to drink all those times because it's a professional matter I'm gonna spit so I'm basically never really drinking wine the only times I'm gonna drink is for a, a special dinner a special occasion when I'm at a restaurant and that's about it and when I drink that's gonna be one that's me because the reasons for that is that I feel that when I taste I need to be very good I need to make the best section possible. And in order to do so, I need to be quite clear, quite, quite clear in my head, and my mouth to be, and palate to be quite clean. So the only way I feel I can do that is by not drinking, by not charging my palate all the time. Again, what I'm saying is just for me, I'm not saying every wine shop, really every wine bar owner should do the same. That's the way I feel comfortable. And do test that. I mean, for, I don't know, two to three days, don't drink alcohol, don't drink juice, don't drink Coke, don't drink over sodas, only drink water, maybe a bit of lime or lemon inside, and maybe it just a touch like It's just like smoking after, well, at least that's what I've heard, after a couple of three, four days stopping smoking, you're gonna feel that you can feel so many more so many more things? Well, a lot more things, and that's the same with eating and drinking. So I need to be in that state to be able to make a selection. So indeed, I don't drink that much. Now, the other reason why I actually don't drink is because in a wine bar, in a wine shop, you've got so many alibis to drink. And just because you're testing wine, just because I mean you've got customers and they're, they're sometimes really happy and they do come and share a glass of wine with us. And again, this might come as a shock to you, and I don't mean to be rude when I say that, but usually, and that usually means really 100% of the time, I won't accept. Or I would say, do you mind if I take a coffee inst instead? Or do you mind if I take something else instead? Because that's my job and I need to be clear about all that. And the second reason is that I've seen too many wine shop owners or wine bar owners falling into drinking too much. I mean, I've even worked with people who can't really handle their drink. Um, and when tasting becomes an alibi to, to drinking, it's to me not a good thing and when being what we call convivial, friendly with customers, becomes about wine drinking. I don't think that's what the customers want, and that's actually not what I want. So, again, if you come here and, and want to share a glass of wine with me, uh, don't be put off. I'm not being rude when I say no, I, I'm, I do want to share this happiness with you, but I won't drink because, again, uh, two reasons easier to select when I don't drink that much and I don't want to drink that much because I don't want to fall into that category of uh, wine professionals who, who, who sometimes can handle their drink and believe me we have the occasion all the time to 
right? taste or to be friendly with customers or suppliers. Uh, and I know some people don't really understand that I do that, but that's the way I am and that's the way I actually handle them. So again, even if it's a shock for you, I actually don't really drink. Doesn't mean I don't know what I'm actually tasting. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty for it when I select. There you go, I hope that answered your question. If you've got more questions, they can be personal, they can be technical, they can be about business, do send them over. You can do that on social media, for example, with Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, or Twitter. You can obviously follow HW on those different social media. I'm going to post unboxings where you're going to see exactly what I've got in store right now. I'm going to post recipes, I'm going to post those videos. And you can basically follow me all week long. If you want to, you don't have to, but if you want to, you can. I hope you're going to have a wonderful week. We're going to see each other very soon. In the meantime, don't forget that you can taste and so keep on tasting. Goodbye.